Hiya, Gina here, LGBT inclusion consultant and trainer, and I'm back with your daily dose of LGBT inclusion best practice. I want you to be aware that not everyone will want to come out or be out at work. There are people all around you that are LGBT, but they may not want to come out. And you may wonder why, why wouldn't they want to come out? Well, there are a thousand different reasons. So for instance, it could be that they may not know what is going on within them, but they know that something isn't quite right. It could be that they may not fully understand it themselves just yet. It could be that they're not comfortable with talking about it because of fear, rejection, questioning, judgments, etc. It could also be that they, they think that it's none of your business, which is totally fine. Whatever the reason, respect it. You don't ask your heterosexual or your cisgendered colleagues to declare or discuss their sexuality or gender identity in the office, so why would you expect others to declare it? We hear all the time about inclusive environments and why it's such a good thing to work towards. And I'm going to reiterate that to you now. Creating an inclusive environment where everyone feels safe to be their true and authentic self is essential. I talk about this all the time. This is psychological safety, okay? Establish a working environment where your LGBT colleagues can be comfortable to bring all of who they are to work. Encourage authenticity at work where all individuals feel safe to express themselves fully with their colleagues, with their customers, with their clients, through their choice of clothing, through their use of preferred pronouns and their name, and there's a hundred different things that I could mention here. But listen, if I can help you with LGBT or intersectionality or psychological safety, please drop me a message. I'd be happy to have a chat with you around consultancy or training for your organisation. I'll see you again tomorrow when I'll be sharing more LGBT best practice. I'll see you then.